This is Apple Vision Pro. After years of anticipation, scrutinizing rumors, analyzing patents, and decoding leaks, the moment we've all been waiting for has finally arrived. Apple introduced its mixed reality headset in WWDC today. The device blends digital content into the space around us, which Apple refers to as spatial computing. The Apple Vision Pro costs $3,499 and is expected to be available in 2024 in US only. Later it will be launched in other countries. It runs on a new operating system called Vision OS, which will support 100,000 familiar apps from iOS and iPad OS. It features a full, three-dimensional interface that can be controlled with your eyes, hands and voice. You can place apps anywhere in AR, overlaid on top of your real-world surroundings. You can navigate the system just by looking and using your eyes, as well as use pinching gestures to select and a flicking gesture to scroll. There's a reality dial on Vision Pro. This allows you to decide how immersed you want to be in virtual reality, or you can allow your real-world surroundings to appear instead. It supports voice input and has Siri integrated to open and close apps, play media, and more. Apple emphasizes not isolating the user, displaying your eyes and expressions through the auto display. When in a fully immersed experience, it shows a different animation, and if someone is nearby, they're revealed to pass through and your eyes reappear. Safari browser is enhanced for Vision Pro, allowing for multitasking with several apps in your view. It can pull out 3D images and content from your Messages app that you can interact with inside the mixed reality environment. Vision Pro works wirelessly with the Mac. It works with Magic Trackpad, Magic Keyboard, and other Bluetooth-enabled, Apple-supported devices. It can provide an additional 4K display for your MacBook just by looking at it. You can use FaceTime on Vision Pro with spatial audio, creating a virtual room with others where voices come from the direction their tile is located in the virtual space. It supports collaboration on apps, including whiteboard and other platforms. You can create a digital persona of yourself as a 3D avatar that can move along with your facial expressions to use it on FaceTime or Zoom calls. Photos can be scrolled through, expanded, or minimized to your liking, with panorama photos looking particularly stunning. It can capture spatial photos and videos. Videos can be played and captured from a 3D, spatial video perspective, making them much more immersive than 2D photos. Watching videos is a cinematic experience. You can scale videos beyond the dimensions of your room, and you can watch 3D movies inside Vision Pro. It can be brought on a plane to enjoy your favorite shows, films, and more right in front of your eyes on a massive virtual screen and it can simulate a dark theater in a bright room. You can play Apple Arcade games like NBA 2K23. 100 arcade titles are available to play from day one, and there is controller support. Apple collaborated with Disney for Vision Pro compatible entertainment, including The Mandalorian, NBA games, Marvel films, and more. Disney Plus will be available on Vision Pro on day one, and you will be able to watch sports events and concerts, or going under the ocean, all through VR and AR. The display uses microLED, includes 23 million pixels across two panels, which is more pixels than a 4K TV per eye. Custom three-layered lenses allow 4K video, HDR, and fine text reading experience at any angle. Personalized sound dual driver audio pods that deliver ambient spatial audio. Vision Pro uses audio tracing to precisely match sound to your room. It has 12 cameras, 5 sensors, and 6 microphones. It uses the M2 chip alongside the new R1 chip, which deals with real-time sensor interaction. Vision Pro is compatible with custom optical inserts that magnetically attach to the lenses, made by Zeiss, for those who wear glasses. The battery life is up to 2 hours with an external battery, or it can be used all day when plugged in. There will be a new app store for the VR headset, allowing you to get as many apps as you want that are compatible with the VR headset. Popular Unity-based games and apps will be available on Apple Vision Pro. It introduces a new biometric security method, Optic ID, which functions like Touch ID and Face ID, but for your eyes. Syncs between iPhone, iPad, and Mac with iCloud. From this point forward, every aspect of this highly anticipated device will be under the microscope from its price and design to its apps. Reactions will vary, with some loving it and others not so much. When I look at Apple Reality Project, I see a 20 years long iterative plan for replacing the iPhone. It is ready to plug into an existing store of millions of apps and now, the conventional constraints of VR controllers are no longer a necessity. We're stepping into a future where we can directly engage with apps in a three-dimensional space using our hands. Apple's latest One More Thing represents the company's vision for the future of computing, and it seems it's going to be an exciting journey.
Despite all these, I still find price to be quite high and I think this device is targeted more towards early adapters. If you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more awesome content. If you want to learn more about art and content creation with AI tools or everything spatial computing related, click here.